even hear them. I don't. They talk and they talk, but I do not hear shit when I'm near them. Bam. We got the comparison right here. The white statics, non-reflective, versus the black statics, non-reflective. Both super clean. I love both these sneakers. I think they are fire. This one is my pair. This one is not. I'm going to have to cop my size if I can get a good deal. Resale is kind of high right now, and I'm never really one to pay resale. I'm always down to sell some shoes for a good profit, but I struggle with paying resale. So we'll see. I might just have to get myself a size 10 in these joints right here now comparison you pretty much got the same texture materials on both the sneakers you got a white and gray on this one and then a black and gray on the new black pair looking at the hill tabs you guys can see the white pair is just plain white just white stitching and the black does have that red uh, I really think it's that pirate black inspired look going on this red stitching running across the black strap in the back outsoles uh, Milky white on here black then you guys can see that boost in there in white now for this comparison There isn't much to say besides this one's white and this one's black It pretty much is just a swap of colors. It's about all I can say honestly but I can't talk about the pros and cons of the two. Starting off this white one, this is the perfect sneaker for summer in my opinion. They are so clean. Perfect summer sneaker, the black pair. Pretty much perfect for fall. They go really well with those darker colors. Now the black though, the black really comes in with a big pro. It doesn't get dirty like these joints are gonna get dirty. White sneakers are a pain in the butt. It's annoying. I love white shoes and I hate white shoes. They look great, but dirty real quick. And once they're dirty, they're they're pretty much done for. It sucks. Black, on the other hand, really doesn't get dirty at all. And when it does, it doesn't show as much as far as that you're gonna get a lot more wear out of these and you're not gonna have to be as cautious compared to these big pro for the black pair what i'm gonna do is i'm actually gonna take these laces i'm gonna put them on this shoe i might even take the laces and put them on this one just kind of give you guys a switch up a little lace swap see how these come out because i honestly think this black yeezy right here with the reflective white laces is gonna pop like crazy it's gonna be Fire. Going on the black ones on here might look all right. We'll see but I'm excited to see what these look like with some white reflective laces There you guys have it a little comparison video. What do you guys think of the sneakers? Were you able to cop either of them? Did you cop both? What do you think of the shoes? What do you think of 350 V2s? What do you think resale is gonna be? Do you think the resale on the black pair is gonna go up or do you think it's gonna go down? Uh, let me know all that good stuff down below Make sure if you're new to the channel, you subscribe. Hit that like button if you like the content. It's your boy, Breezy Kicks. We out.